What do you want, Baba? You want to be in the photo? <laughs> Say hi. Hi. Kisses. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay, you can go now. Mama is busy, okay? Go. Thank you. Yes, I'm going to be showing you how to make garden eggs. Uh, we call this in my country, impwa. How to make impwa the Zambian way without adding any water, zero water, okay? So, hey guys, I'm back and I have all the ingredients ready. First of all, you need your cooking stick and your pot. Make sure it's a really nice uh, big pot. And now the ingredients. You need your impua, garden eggs, tomatoes, and this was two uh, big tomatoes, and you need onion, one large onion, a whole large onion. You don't need to use half. Salt, whatever salt you're going to use is okay, and you need your oil, okay? That's all. These are the ingredients you need. So I'm going to set the stove on fire. And we're going to start with oil. This is my used oil. Zambian people, we never throw away used oil. We always keep our used oil. Okay, so you have your oil in there. As you can see, there is no water, zero water, just oil. And you have to start with the tomatoes at the bottom. And the onions. Oh my God, I think this pot is not going to be... I think this pot is not going to be enough. I don't think it's the right size for all my ingredients. Your salt. This is how we measure salt in my country. Okay, we use our eyes and our hands. We don't use those measuring cups. Okay, I think this is good. As you can see, again, no water, zero water. So uh, you don't have to wait for it to start cooking. Just start adding your impua on top. Once again, as you can see, guys, zero water. You see? Woo! Oh. <laughs> That's my oil. Ah. I need to add more because I spilled some. As you can see, guys, zero water. This is just my ingredients, okay? So grab your uh, lid and cover. Make sure that it is sealed and covered. And make sure that the heat is on low, okay? Because you don't want to hurry up this vegetable and make the heat cook it faster. It's not going to have enough uh, time to squeeze out all the juices, all right? So you need to slow cook it, like soup. Okay. We'll be back. Mwah. I swear to God, I did not add any water into this pot. Zero water, okay? So I'm just going to show you the magic, okay? I'm gonna show you the magic. Don't know if you can see. Look at that. Look at that water floating. So now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna stir it 
make sure the bottom comes to the top and the top goes to the bottom okay and you don't want to crush it so you have to do it gently this is how you turn it you don't want your import to break okay you just want it as is you don't want it to break oh my god oh my god look at that juice this is all the juice from the vegetables juice from the vegetable nothing else and you know how tart and sweet it's going to be no water added zero water all the juice oh my god oh my god beautiful oh my god isn't that beautiful so beautiful oh my god so yummy you're gonna cover again hey guys so this is the end result of the import don't worry about the juice not being thick this is how it's supposed to be it's natural juice it's not water so it's still tasty and juicy despite being this watery and i'm having it with shima this is corn and this is how we have it in my country zambia i'm going to show you how we eat our food First, we wash our hands, make sure it's clean. And this is how we do it. You grab the shima. Oh my God, this is hot. I'm gonna put it up. Okay, so. You make a bowl, you make a bowl. And when you make the bowl, make a hole inside the bowl by pressing on top so that it's like this. And this is where your soup is going to go in. And, oh, this is hot. Like that, it should look like this. Mm. this is so perfect this is the perfect soup ever and the impua here we have the impua the garden eggs so most people just eat it as is but I love to remove the scales I mean the outer layer of the impua. I love to remove this and just eat the insides. <laughs> and just eat the insides. So hot. Oh my God, this is so hot. So, mm, mm. perfect. Mm, mm. Thank you for watching, guys. I hope you like it. Go ahead and try it at home. Let me know about the results, so what you think, how it's gonna test. And please, please, please be honest. Do not add any water. You will just see how the whole soup is gonna turn out at the end as the vegetable, the impulse starts draining all those juices, you know. So thank you guys for watching and subscribe like and follow for more videos if you like me to keep posting cooking videos let me know in the comments below i love you